You've heard of emotional support animals, but an emotional support peacock? Probably not. Well, this bird was not cleared for flight at LAX after its owner tried to take it on a plane. Tonight, United Airlines is speaking out about why they made the peacock give up its seat. Yeah, KCAL Nights' Crystal Cruz is live at LAX with this colorful tale tonight. And I think having a peacock on a plane would actually stress me out, not help me. <laughs> Maybe out. a little bit. You know what some passengers did say? Uh, they're noisy, and you know, if a baby's on board, who knows what would happen between crying and a peacock being noisy. But tonight, uh, or actually over the weekend, United not ready to let this peacock fly. Whatever helps passengers get through the flight works for me. A few passengers at LAX Tuesday night on board with most emotional support animals or ESAs flying, but there's limits. A snake is a little much. I mean, seeing snakes on a plane, it's almost a cliche. Social media shows ESAs like a pig, monkey, turkey, duck, kangaroo, and now a peacock tried to take flight too. I have them by my house. They're really loud. I can't imagine that on a plane next to a screaming baby. <laughs> According to Instagram, a woman wanted to fly to LA from New Jersey with her ESA peacock named Dexter, but was told that will not fly. United Airlines not having a bird on board. Travel expert David Fleming. Can you imagine if that peacock uh, jumped over a seat and started flailing its wings and feathers. It would be beautiful, but it would be scary at the same time. A spokesperson with United Airlines told us this animal did not meet guidelines for a number of reasons, including its weight and size. We explained this to the customer on three separate occasions before they arrived at the airport. Look, people will try to bring an animal on and say it's an emotional support animal, it may or may not be. Some online question the legitimacy of Dexter as an ESA and call this a mockery of the program. We tried to reach his owner without luck. This is Dexter, Dexter the Peacock. According to Instagram, the pair seen here in a video posted to Facebook by Global Fashion News that he would prefer living on a farm versus right. an apartment. Chose to drive across country instead of fly. And United says they are reviewing their emotional support policy, but say most large animals fly as cargo. I'm Crystal Cruz reporting live from LAX tonight. I'll send it back to you in the studio. Yeah, it's a talker. A lot of people talking about that story tonight.